Sometimes all I want to do is shut my eyes and tell the world to go to hell. Hey guys, I'm Darkina. Welcome back to Life is Strange Before the Storm Part 2 of the first episode. So, in the previous episode, we crashed into the firewalk party. We met some bad guys, got into a fight. Rachel and Bruce saved our asses and... Uh, went back to the party, rock hard, and then now we are at home. We are gonna just look at the journal first because last time I don't know what happened, but it didn't just. Daily uh, rituals are important, even when they involve writing unread letters to friends who have forgotten you. It didn't show these stuff. I don't know why, but now they showed. Um, so I'll uh, yeah, I will leave you just read them by yourself. Because I won't really have time to right now. So here's some messages from Chloe to Max. Unfortunately, Max isn't reading them for some reasons. But yeah, here we go. Oh, that's a principle of Blackwell. I uh, forgot the boldy too. Okay, anyway. Let's exit and just uh, see what's going on around. Damn, she got lots of posters in her room. I love that. Oh, photo... Uh, okay. Hey, Max. Hey, Dad. Another day in paradise. Oh. Uh, right? Well, yeah, a big part of Chloe's story is how she feels like she Whoa. lost her... Wakey, wakey, eggs and bacon. Oh, eggs. I love Last eggs. Night, seeing Firewalk live. The skeevy assholes. That... Girl. Was that really Rachel Amber? Oh, she she doesn't know her yet. You smell like cigarettes and beer. Better change clothes. Okay, so as I was saying, a uh, big part of Chloe's story is how she feels like she lost her best friend in Max. And what's really interesting is that if you recall the flashbacks from Life is Strange, Chloe was a whole different girl when Max was around her in her life. And she wasn't so like... Uh, misguided, I think that's the word I should put. She made better decisions uh, when Max was around. I'm so excited to see how she changed and all the type of people she got involved with after Max left. Ugh, and I still smell like last night. I really need to change. Yeah, she's pretty much her life is now is so messed up. That's that's it. Uh huh. Yeah, now I remember I was so obsessed checking everything in rooms in Life is Strange. I bet long Max Silver traded her hat for beer and booty long ago. Okay, oh, we have a skateboard. She was a skateboarder. Used to love skateboarding. It's the only mode of transportation that doubles as a middle finger to authority. <laughs> I think she still uh, uses a skateboard in her uh, school. Mom said I was too young to go. She was wrong, and it was awesome. All right, I used to be obsessed checking everything in the rooms. I'm still right as now. As awesome as some of those shows with Elliot were, they were nothing compared to Firewalk last night. Who's Elliot? I think he's much more of a boyfriend right now. I saved all of these. You have to delete that photo of me dancing. <laughs> Only you could get me to loosen up like that. Happy two month anniversary, Elliot. Literally any amount. We'll take it. Anyway, um, let's open this up. Max made me this mix CD years ago. And because it was Max, not a single song was pirated. Aw. <laughs> yeah, this is the difference between Max and Chloe. Max is always legit. Ms. Mr. Sharky, hello! Hello, Fun Mr. Facts. Shacky. Shark babies eat their siblings in the womb. Ho oh, ho. Maybe that's why I'm an only child. I got a fancy post. Tear it down, no. Used to dream of riding a unicorn as a kid. But then all the unicorns died. Aw. That's so sad. Oh, look at that beer. <laughs> Bask, ye mortals, in the light of the glowy bear. Dad was so proud of me for winning that stupid science fair. Yeah, she was, you know, she was a great student. And uh, now she's bad at everything. Just because her father died too. And her best friend wasn't near her anymore. Ask Miss Arcadia. 
You're the only source of info I trust in this town. Oh, it looks like a, a teeny tiny Facebook. Okay, what's that? Um, all right. Wait, what? Who? What photo? Victoria Chase, com commanded on the photo you tagged in. Oh, the, the same old Victoria Chase. Can I, uh, can I click at the link? I oh. have feelings about this. Most of them are not good hey, feelings. Hey, who put the photo here? You look hot. Who's the arm candy? Deborah something. Dude, that's Chloe. Oh, th they thought Chloe was Deborah. Okay, enough of this. Oh, um, all right. That really was Rachel Amber. And she saved my life. How was last night even real? The only person that I recognize from here is, Clo is uh, uh, Victoria. Uh, yeah, I forgot the other people. Yeah, Warren. Yeah, that's Warren. We have Zachary, Trevor, Alyssa. Yeah, Alyssa, I remember. Yeah, I, I forgot they still in here. Improve the periodic table. How am I supposed to improve the periodic table? Better living through chemistry. Oh, Mary Jane 420. Okay. Why can't you be more positive? Aw. Put on and stuff. Switch off. You know, uh, let's get out of here. I should at least check out my dresser before I leave. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Yeah, it's dresser time. You know, I will take too much time to get her dressed, guys. Because I know that there's lots of uh, dresses out here to, uh, to see. Oh, damn. She got a lot of shirts. Bonus outfit. I will to totally check out bonus outfit because I bought the deluxe edition hot dog man illuminati uh punk dough let's go to punk dough <laughs> I really want to check out the hot dog man too because it's funny oh hello oh it looks good on her okay we are gonna try that one all right we're gonna do it. Exit. Plus, she look hot and black. I love black as well. Can't leave without my vitamins. Oh shit! All right. Yes, that's the weed from last night. <laughs> Thanks, Frank. You're a good guy. I really should get going. Shit. Where's my phone? It's not here. How drunk was I last night? Chloe, I said breakfast. Guess I better try calling my phone with mom's. Okay. She only drank one beer. A hmm. half of a bottle. Mom's phone is probably in her room. I can use it to call mine, then figure out where the hell I left it. Yeah, towel, nothing special. Senior. Mom's hiding her gray hair to impress her boyfriend. Maybe gray hair's his kryptonite. Maybe I should dye my hair gray. Oh, maybe you should dye your hair blue. Um, I love the voice actress now. It's like, I really got through it. Plus, I forgot Chloe's voice. It's been a long time since I've played the game, so I don't quite remember. Anyway, we are in the mom's room. Mom's old engagement ring. Supposed to be mine, if I'm ever stupid enough to get married. All right. Grade B? Fuck you, Arcadia Pond. Wait, Mom's selling her engagement ring? <gasps> no! I think they don't have enough money. So, that's... Can't what, believe I used to sneak in there that. for her makeup. Okay, uh, open the drawer. See what's inside, dirty secrets. I hate that she hides all our old pictures of dad. Okay, bless. Place on the dresser, yeah. You don't deserve to be stuck in a drawer like this.
Oh yeah, the Illuminati eye means that this action will have consequences. So, yeah, I don't know what consequence is gonna leave, but it's the right thing, I guess. It's in here. Oh, 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 okay, David okay, comes here for dinner. Freaking close your eyes. <laughs> Man, why didn't she freaking throw him in the trash? Damn it, Mom. They're only candy wrappers. How can Mom look at this every day and not see what a tool she's dating? Yeah, the step douche. Step douche is here. Did you find anything interesting? Oh, okay, she was calling her phone. I totally forgot. I'm not paying attention to the dialogues. Sorry. Did she find it? Sounds like my phone is definitely nearby. The toilet? Are you freaking kidding me? Oh. Oh, it's in the... There oh, we go. okay. I thought it was in the uh, under how many calls toilet. Okay, that's Elliot. Will you be joining us for supper? No thanks. Uh, will you coming home s uh, at some point tonight? Chloe, will you be coming home by curfew? There will be consequences for mommy. Okay, let's see the message from Elliot. Uh huh. Hmm. Okay, Spanish test. Blah blah blah. I think I <laughs> did okay. What's up to you? You finished the chem homework? Nope. Do it the third time. I already know everything. Chloe, yeah. breakfast. Bring my puss down with you, please. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I think I saw Mom's purse in her room. And yeah, mom, I'm coming. I'm grabbing you the freaking perch. All right. Oh, can you grab my cell phone too? Come on. I hate when my mom tells me to bring something and then she remembers that she forgot something, then she yeah. tells me to bring that it back really to you. That really makes me want to hurry. All right. Let's go downstairs. Coming, mom. Finally, you can put my purse on the dining table. Might still have time for breakfast if you hurry. Dining table, here I come. <laughs> who the fuck says that? Like, seriously, who the fuck says dining table, here I come? Literally. Hey, mom, you making some breakfast? Okay, let's put the purse. Chloe, I don't have all day. Would you get over here already? I should see what mom wants before she strokes out. Oh, uh, drama. You know how to talk to her anyway. Button. We're already supporting one. Thanks. Hmm. <laughs> Very funny. What's this? Jane. From when Max and I spilled mom's wine. I think the only reason mom hasn't recarpeted is so she can stay mad at me. <laughs> oh, fuck. What the hell? this made that for mom in an art class when i was like five she was never a smoker but it's cool i was never an artist wait those aren't mom's keys and these would be david's keys oh there's probably a better place for them than the ashtray i made mom <laughs> like his home maybe okay um the snow dough Oh, let's shake the snow dough. I really love that kind of things. Oh, <laughs> Come on, Chloe. She's about to break it down. Little dude's like, what the hell just happened? <laughs> yeah, I'm like, what the hell just happened? What the fuck? Swear jar. Dad's old swear jar. We spent the last of his curses on bus fare and milk. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, let's talk to mommy. Hey, Mom. You wanted to talk? When I send you a text message, Chloe, like last night, I need you to answer. Mm. You can just say text. You don't have to say message. 
and I need you to answer without the snark. Okay, um, so I'll do better or I was sleeping. Okay, whatever. Sorry, I hear you. I'll do better about replying. Thank you. Is that what you wanted to talk about? What is it with you and David? Always cutting to the chase. Why can't we just have some pleasant conversation before school? Um, uh, yeah, let's talk about the engagement ring because this is special dialogue. Are you selling your engagement ring? Chloe, jewelry gets appraised for all sorts of reasons. Like for insurance. Ah, uh, yikes. Nice dodge. How about this? You don't go in my bedroom when I'm not there. Oh, but How about you don't ask me to get your damn purse then? Yep, that's what I was gonna say. Um, David. You do realize you I hate your boyfriend with every fiber of my being, right? Chloe! You don't hate him. He calls me girly. He's a dickhole. He can be old-fashioned. Yeah, an old-fashioned dickhole. Oh my god, come on, Chloe. God damn it. That's why I sometimes just hate Chloe. Uh, because she's not mature. She, she, she wants to ah, be like that. Right. School. My favorite. You used to love to learn. Yeah. I used to think drugs were lame too. I wish you wouldn't joke like that. Let's not fight. I made you breakfast. Nah. I'll just grab something later. Oh, you'll enjoy this. The other day I made four eggs, two for David, two for me. And just before I served them, he says, what are you going to eat? Oh, okay. Thanks, douchebag. Huh? Firewalk? Is that the band you mentioned last week? I'm still bummed you wouldn't let me go. Oh. Mm-hmm. She what? I know what time you came home last oh, night. Oh shit! Shouldn't, and don't think you can get out of school just because you missed the bus again. Why would you assume that? Who do you think your principal calls when you skip? Do you think I enjoy lying for you, saying you're sick just so you don't get expelled? Okay, drama. And I do know what pot smells like, you know. Oh shit! She's smelling the Between pot. Between your grades and your disregard for my rules. I see you slipping. I'm worried. But mom, the whole point of lowering expectations is so you won't be disappointed in me. Ever again. You're happy doing what you're doing? Fine. Keep at it. Just let me know so I can stop fighting with Blackwell to keep you on scholarship. Money's tight enough as it is. Yeah. Maybe I just need to be left alone. Maybe David could help. <laughs> Okay, seriously, why is he doing? Maybe David should start paying rent. He spends the night often enough. Shit. How do you know? You're never here yourself. David thinks you need discipline. David should mind his own business. I think it's great David's taking an interest. He's a good man. Maybe he can help. <laughs> I love her ponytail on the thing that put there. Um, David was a good man. Dad was a good man, sorry. David is an asshole. Chloe should just be okay with her mom uh, trying to live her life. Like, her dad passed away, but to her mom still can be, like, having her own life. That's what I think. So, dad was a good man. Yeah. I don't need to say dad that... Dad was a good man. David is an That's asshole. That's not fair. I'm... Glad... Your father still has a place in your heart. But sometimes we need to make more room in our hearts for new people. And sometimes, when we're incredibly desperate and lonely, we choose the absolute wrong kind of people to let into our hearts. Oh. Mom. Please. David's had some hard times too, you know. If he's kind enough to share his experience, I expect you to listen. Like I'd let him get within 15 feet of me. When he takes you to school today. Uh-oh. Very funny. You will be nice. You will be respectful. And you will say thank you. Uh -oh. Are you serious? This is such... What, Chloe? Such what? <sighs> Mom's trying. I guess. Maybe I should, too. But what's the point in getting along if it means pretending everything's fine when it's not?
Wow, okay. Be understanding or say what, what you feel. I don't fucking want to say what Chloe feels. Be understanding. Mom, I know you're dealing with a lot. Thank you. I understand you don't need me as much anymore. But I need you. I do still need you. You're my mom. Aww. I'm proud of you for being so self-sufficient. But the whole world's not out to get you. Tell that to the world. You're impossible. But I love you. I love you too. Mm-hmm. Okay, David's waiting. Mm -hmm. You'll need to bring him his keys from the ashtray. Try not to kill each other. You got it. <laughs> Unless he tries nice to one. give me advice. Or looks at me funny. Chloe. Or looks at me at all. Chloe. Mom. Have a good day. You too. You too. Bringing David okay. his keys is about the most humiliating thing Mom could ask me to do. Just shut up, man. Please. Um, David is an asshole sometimes. I'm not saying that he's not. But we all know that he was a good, good stepdad in the last Life is Strange, especially at the end. I was shocked. Okay, let's take the keys from the ashtray and uh <laughs> What the hell? No point in putting off the inevitable torture of driving to school with David. I better get going. Um okay, okay, okay. What's where's the uh where's the thing? Where's the garage? Alright, um Yes. I can feel that something bad is going to happen right here. So let's leave. What a piece of crap. The car, too. Aw, oh, come on. Why do you women always take forever to get ready? We're hoping you men will leave without us. No, Mom. I swear he beat himself to death with a tire iron. Repeatedly. <laughs> mm. Alright. I don't like this. My true insulator's probably cracked. You know what a spark plug does? Yes. It ignites Did you not hear me? I said I know what it does. Yeah, we started. Go grab my socket wrench set from the garage, and we can get moving. What is this? Quality time? Ugh. Better just get the socket wrench and get this over with. <laughs> okay. Um, where is it? Oh, it's really weird to come back to the garage. I still remember it from What's David from doing? Leaving stuff in our garage anyway. Does he think he's moving in or something? I used to love Max more than Chloe in the first, uh, in the first season. And now, Chloe just makes me hear her more. I know that everybody loved Chloe. Dad's old camera. But... <laughs> Do they even make film for these oh, anymore? Oh, this is the camera she gives to uh, Max, right? Okay, we found out something new. And we where is the uh where is the toolbox? Here we go. Uh what's the thing written in her hand? Oh wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait, wait. Socket rush set. Oh, so these are the objectives we have to. This is really a nice thing. You can look at your hand, and you find the objective. Oh my god, I really love this. 50-50 chance I smash him in the face with this. 60-40. Maybe 90-10. <laughs> Grew up. Okay, let's just give it to him. And we'll get back to Blackwell. I'm really, really excited to see Blackwell and uh, Chloe no being in her school with her friends and stuff. This is awkward. See what's gunking up the works there? That's a sign carbon of carbon deposits. Deposit. No shit. You know, you could actually be good at this. 
If you lost the attitude. Oh my god. My attitude is what makes me special, David. All right. I just realized that David's voice is so bad. Oh, except fist bump. Oh my god, this is awkward. But we're gonna accept it. Fine. Whatever. Oh shit, this is awkward. Damn it. I don't know why they changed all the voice actors in these prequel. Hey, you're taking those tools with you, right? Every house needs a good toolbox. Oh, damn. So bad. <sighs> We've already got one, but thanks. <laughs> oh, is he making fun of her dad's toolbox? That's that's lame. Oh god. Ready to roll? Please don't want to talk. Please don't want to talk. I want to talk to you about something. Uh oh. Fuck. We don't have to like each other, but you will respect me. You've enjoyed enough of a vacation from having a father figure. So there's some things I want to be real clear about. Shut. <laughs> Shut this down. Or ignore and endure. Yeah. Mm hmm. Joyce, your mother, she's hurting, Chloe. Hurting for you. You've had it rough, no doubt about it. But all this staying out late, ignoring her command, drinking, drug use, it's making everything harder for her. You need to shape up, get your act together, and put someone else first for a damn change. Am I making myself clear? Is it crazy if part of what David's saying makes sense to me? Um, got it. Got it. Got it. Thanks. We should really get going. Oh, and by the way... Glad we understand each other. I don't think that David is the security guard from Blackwell. Because now I think he doesn't have a job or something. Uh, so this is really weird, not seeing uh, David in Blackwell anymore. So I think I will end the video right here. I'm really excited to continue the story and see uh, the relationship with Chloe and Rachel throughout the game and getting to know Rachel more. But sometimes I'm just like, hey, can I, should I do like one hour uh, gameplay of Life is Strange before the storm? And I remember that my internet connection is just as slow as a snail so this is really impossible but i will try and make these videos uh when i'm free and i'm not in college so thank you so much for watching the video if you like it please leave a like it will be always appreciated and i'll see you guys in the next one peace